In this example, mating the front static gear to the camshaft by the end faces creates a small interference. This is because an offset is required, which typically would have to be added after creating the mate. Now, you have the ability to edit the implicit mate connector's location directly from within the mate dialog. We can move or realign either or both mate connectors. In this case, we'll simply move one mate connector back by a small amount to create the necessary clearance. On the Documents page, Onshape Search has been improved. When navigating into a folder, the search will now default to look within that folder or any subfolders. You may also select to exclude subfolders from the search results. When copying a document, the dialog has been improved, allowing you to specify a folder location. The copy will be created at this specified location, but the document page will maintain at the location of the original. You can quickly open the copy from the bubble message at the top. Right-clicking on a document at the Documents page, you'll find the option to make public. New with this release, you'll see an additional confirmation dialog. This not only prevents accidental selection, but fully explains the implications of making a document public before you complete the action. Additionally, within the Public tab of the Share dialog, a new, bolder warning has also been added. These changes aim to increase awareness and security without adding any additional friction to sharing your designs as you need. You can now customize your release management watermark text. From Company Settings, navigate to Release Management and scroll down to find the new option to edit watermarks. You can update what text will be displayed as the watermark for one or more of your release states. Clicking the Save button, changes will take effect immediately. Any applicable drawings will now display your custom text as their watermark. Thanks for watching. Click the logo to subscribe or see some of our other videos linked here.